Arthur Lewin from the beginning after the end is broken. Spoilers for the novels, by the way. Currently in the novels, Arthur Lewin has a ether core, and this allows Arthur combined with Sylvie and Regis to use the three branches of ether, which are space, time, and existence. Through this, Arthur is able to use insanely broken abilities, such as God Step, giving him basically instant teleportation, and being able to stop time and erase people from existence. Additionally, with all of this, Arthur is able to use the power of fate, which is an insanely broken version of reality and causality manipulation on a multiversal level. This is 100% unique plus to multiversal or higher because it's able to affect alternate space times like the relic tombs or Cecilia and Grey's old home. Arthur has way more abilities than just this, for example his King's Gambit, which allows him to see and predict countless possible futures. And I can make an entire video just listing out all of Arthur's hacks. But let's move on to Arthur's stats, such as Arthur's speed which is massively faster in light with some scales getting it 80,000 times FTL. And this isn't even including Burst Step, which briefly allows Arthur's combat speed and striking speed to become unquantifiably faster, where that Arthur can't even see his own strikes. When it comes to AP, I have Arthur easily planetary plus, and a lot of scalers have him near solar to galaxy level through using core and layer multipliers because the beginning after the end has a universal energy system. However, attack potency doesn't really matter for Arthur because he has existence erasure with destruction. And I just want to remind you that Arthur Lewin is not at his peak just yet, because we haven't seen Arthur use fate at his true potential, and we have an entire volume of T-Bait left. 